Hi, I'm Dr. Roger Edwards. I'm CEO of a small uh, Australian startup biotech company called Neural Diagnostics. We're commercialising a technology that we have licensed from Monash University. It was invented there. It's called electrovestibulography or EVSG. This is what you see behind us. And it's, a, it's an electrophysiological measurement technique, a very novel one that measures brain waves in special ways from the ear canal. From, and we're picking up signals from the balance system that is intimately linked to the emotional, behavioral, and cognitive centers of the brains. And we think we're, we're finding biomarker patterns that are unique for different conditions. We've had three PhD students successfully examined. One's looked at uh, Parkinson's disease, one's looked at uh, depression, one's looked at schizophrenia. And we're sufficiently confident that we've now uh, expanding uh, but focusing on mild traumatic brain injury, which is why we're going to be working with Dr. Mark Mahler. My name is Dr. Jerome Mahler. I'm a neuroscientist and an NHMRC Industry Career Development Fellow, and I focus on mild traumatic brain injury. Or more specifically, I look for markers of anywhere in the brain that might indicate that the person has had mild traumatic brain injury. So traditionally, we use MRI technology. I've just got some examples here. So we have typical MRI images here that don't show much damage, but I now focus on the advanced imaging that shows little parts of the brain that might be uh, damaged after a mild traumatic brain injury. I then use more advanced technology such as diffusion tensor imaging, which tries to colorize and track the connection fibers in the brain. We're trying to look for any sort of breaks or breakdown in integrity of those fibers, which traditional imaging will not show. EVSG is important because I believe it will show signals that are different to people who haven't had mild traumatic brain injury, and this will be in addition to the information that the MRI is giving to me. The specific information will be related to parts of the brain that are known to be related to mild traumatic brain injury, yet are not picked up by any sort of MRI technology. This means that we can then focus on the parts of the brain that are now implicated in the mild traumatic brain injury and try and treat those areas where previously they would have come through as a normal finding and therefore not targeted for treatment. EVSG comes from Dr. Brian Lithgow, who was at Monash University. And so this is the only EVSG chair in Australia of this model. We have one other model, which is almost the same, which is based in Manitoba in Canada. So we run experiments in two countries. So Brian Lithgow and Professor Jay Shri Kulkarni uh, together won the New Inventors uh, Award in 2010. And based on that, we've really progressed in our, in our uh, research since then, recruited many more people. So at the moment, we're recording a baseline reading coming from the ears, from the vestibular system. And now we're going to rotate the person and we'll be recording the field potentials coming from the vestibular system. So now we're recording the field potentials coming from the vestibular system with the person on this rotation. And now we're collecting the vestibular systems, which is the brain reaction to being re-tilted back towards the middle. <laughs> 